Hey people, if you know me or follow me since beginning, then you know I make videos related to the subjects under life sciences, that is educational videos, molecular technology videos, job related videos, etc, etc. But, 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 if you are new to this channel, I request you all to support and go through the channel because that will help you to clear all your doubts. In fact, I would say let's grow together. I am just like you all did my BSc and MSc. So thought my experience would, you know, guide you or uh, help you to, you know, follow the correct path. Many people actually, many people will tell you about the career and the subjects involved. But I want to help you all to understand the life after, you know, the after you get a job or uh, practically how the things go after you get a degree in this. Uh, so let's, you know, let's start with the introduction and today's video now. Hola people, welcome back to my channel Life Science. Fantastic. <laughs> Till now I was telling you all about the courses available in Life Science in India. Vese to, there are a lot more, but I guess wo to chalta hi rehne wala hai. I feel I should discuss about the jobs after BSc, MSc in Life Sciences. Now, what are we waiting for? Let's get started. There are ample number of jobs available in life sciences like vaccine production, vaccine development, QC, food technologist, biologist, research scientist, lab technician, marine illustrator, lecturer, assistant professor, JRF, bioinformatics analyst, bioinformatics trainer, geneticist, genetic counselor, etc, etc. Now let's discuss them one by one with the companies you can target for. Well, 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 if you're interested in the pharma side of the life science field, then you are you have options or, uh, you know, you can work as in the QC department or the vaccine production or the vaccine development, etc. The companies you should target for are Lupin, Serum Institute, Biocon, Glenmark, Mylan, Reliance Life Science, GSK, Blue Cross, Sinjin, Dr. Reddy's, etc. Mm, not pharma, then I guess you are interested in the microbiology part of the life science field. Mm, that means you can actually apply for QC in microbiology or as microbiologist in pathology, food and beverage industry, etc. The companies you should go for are Metropolis, SRL, Apollo, Sula Wineries or Amul, etc, etc. Or any other dairy companies is like ready to hire you. Um, no pharma, no microbiology, uh, then I guess you're just like me. I mean, if you're a biotechnologist or a geneticist or a molecular biologist, then you have opportunities like open opportunities in molecular diagnostic companies as research associate, scientist or lab technician. Plus, you have good scope in clinical research. By the way, a biotechnologist should definitely target institutions or companies like ECTREC, that is A-C-T-R-E-C, -E uh, then Datar Cancer Genetics, Thermo Fisher Scientific, then um, Lilac, Medgenome, GenePath, then LifeCell, then uh, BioNivid, NGB Diagnostics, MapMyGenome, etc, etc. There are many companies available in India right now who hire for the above mentioned uh, positions. Um, well, you are the one interested in the analysis part, I, I mean the bioinformatics part of the life science field, then you have a job or you have job opportunities in and as NGS data analysis or to develop the NGS data analysis pipeline. The companies you guys should target for are uh, Perian, uh, that is the major bioinformatics company, or any other biotechnology company like Data Cancer Genetics, BioNivid, NGB Diagnostics, Clevergene, etc. etc. Lastly, if you guys are interested in joining the government institutions or become a professor, then you have to qualify NET, that is NET, SET, that is SET, or GATE, that is GET. After qualifying these entrance exams, um, you have you will get an entry in government institutions like CCMB, ETREC, uh, IISC, 
NCL, then um, NCBS, etc., etc. You will be entering these institutions as a JRF, that is Junior Research Fellow. Or you get an assistant professor position in any institution. I guess that's it for today, guys. Uh, I hope this video was quite informative for you all out there. And uh, I request you all to stay tuned uh, for my next video. Uh, okay, then. Bye-bye, guys. Doodles.